Dog years I've been hearing from police agencies about the hundreds and hundreds of useless burglar alarms I installed all, all over southwestern Pennsylvania and the bum fucks of West Virginia. How funny you can be cleared of all charges, like by the hundreds, and still be on the radar because of the hundreds and even thousands of people who received, installed, or bypassed a burglar alarm system. And then there are the criminals alone or as a group who burglarize houses. I happen, you know, in which I installed an alarm. It puts my name in the same snake pit with everyone else's. I do not in any way blame my narcotics addiction on this fulminating fortune cookie full of prune plutonium and a teasing platitude baked in the center. It's like the next 80,000 words in a toxic fortune cookie. Me and Rosie were addicted to hard drugs long before we met, and I was half the way I am now before I got involved with Mike Spuke's alarm business. I've been preaching a secular religion for when you can't entirely exit your life from the walking, shitting equivalent of Satan. He's in the hood. Same as Julius and Ethel Smith. And all of Bruno Richard Hauptmann's great-grand nieces, with whom we've had nothing but gracious company. This is a civilized, conciliary posture similar to praying. I've undertaken the lumping task of forgiving not only Mike Spuke, but his entire family. His last four generations, both by birth and marriage, and everyone related to the filthy cocksucker now. The Spuke dynasty is so pervasive in Pittsburgh that you can't get sued for divorce without being torted by a Spuke. It's worse than that, though. This is why I profess a docile and logical sugar substitute for Christian fundamentalism. I forgive the Spukes for being the secular Satans that they are. Speaking of forgiveness, secular or deity motivated, the gang of Nazis who gave us a gallon of Dilaudid a few weeks ago have been coming over regularly and singing along with the other people we've gotten real close to with lightning speed. You gotta love Julius and Ethel Smith for the way they commandeer the spinet piano. This is among the best skill sets one can apply when everyone has vomitosed from elsewhere fast and holed up quick as snot in February in the back hills down here. 